everyone, Arlen here. Welcome back to my Country Craft Corner. How in the world are you guys doing today? So good to see you. Thank you so, so much for stopping back by to see what I'm up to in my car today. <laughs> and I know I'm really close. I'm sorry about that, but I'm trying my best here. We have not had a chance to get back and work with that camera, you guys. Uh, I've been so busy. I've been so busy with the challenges and editing videos and decorating my house. And I just haven't had a chance to get back to uh, working with that camera. Uh, but I'm coming to you today. Well, I'm, so I'm using my phone and I have a, a bracket to put my phone on, but this, the Outback is not quite as big in the front as my van was. So I know I'm, I'm, I'm sure I'm pretty close. <laughs> Sorry about that. But so I thought I would take this opportunity since I am so busy and and just moving and shaking at all times of the day and night, literally over here <laughs> to go ahead and film my reminder video for our lantern. Sorry for our lantern centerpiece challenge that <clears throat> will be going up uh, next Wednesday the 26th uh, and again I will be opening up a playlist for all of you creators to add your videos to and most of you seem to be able to be doing that there's some of you who aren't able and I don't I'm not quite sure why that is uh, that some can and some can't I'm thinking I'm wondering if it could be because you're trying from a mobile phone I don't know whether that's or a mobile device I don't know whether that's the that's the case or not <clears throat> but I'm thinking it may not give you an option on a mobile device to add a video you may need to go to a computer but I'm not positive on that note to be honest with you guys at all so we'll just keep doing it the way we're doing it and if you can't get your video into the playlist just email me at our lens a-r-l-y-n-n-s c c c at gmail.com and i will add it for you now i am not at my my computer as you know all the time i'm going to be out and doing stuff so i will i promise you that i will get your video loaded into that playlist as soon as i possibly and humanly can <laughs> also a reminder to you subscribers who have been rocking these challenges oh my goodness gracious you guys the talent the talent that has and creativity that has been coming from you guys for these challenges has been amazing and has blown me completely away uh i'm going to ask you to please send me your one picture of your of your uh lantern centerpiece by that please tuesday so later than noon on tuesday please 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 uh you know i i I'm trying my best here. <laughs> so, but I will uh, gladly and humbly create that video for you guys uh, for the lantern centerpiece for you subbies. And I can't wait to see what you guys have come up with. Oh, we already have about eight or ten pictures now from you guys. So I can't wait to see what you come up with. Uh, but anyway, so that's it. That's my reminder for the Lantern Centerpiece Challenge. Kim and I, I'm telling you guys, are overwhelmed with the support and the participation for these three challenges. We so, so, so appreciate it. Uh, and we hope that, uh, that it's helping your channels to grow a little bit and for you to gather some subscribers and share your wonderful creativity with them and then uh, that's the reason we do this to share we do this to share with the crafting community and with those who are looking for ideas you know a lot of people go to Pinterest as a matter of fact rich you said this in your uh, Q&A the other day uh, you know a lot of people go to Pinterest for inspiration for certain things uh, but just as many, if not more, come to YouTube for inspiration, you know, and they do a search and they put in keywords and, and, you know, let's say they're trying to find a tiered tray to do or, or trying to figure out how to, a lantern or a centerpiece for their table, you know, for the autumn or for the fall season, you know, 
So uh, this gives people a place to go and search and things to find, you know, things to find on YouTube that will help them hopefully create something beautiful in their own homes. So I can't tell you how grateful I am to all of you who are participating and adding to my playlist. And Kim and I, like I say, we came up with these ideas way back in the summertime. And it is so rewarding to see them all coming to fruition now. <laughs> so thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> It's something pretty special when you see a community come together like this, though, you know, it's something very, very special. And I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. Uh, but anyway, I'm not going to yammer on too, too much longer here in my car chit chat. I, I just really wanted to remind you guys of, of the challenge and oh, the three, I forgot to name the three rules. The three rules for this challenge are... You need to use a tray, a lantern, and then you need to put a bow topper on the lantern. And not just put a bow on there, not just tie a bow on, but do something with the bow. Augment the bow, add a little something or you know other to the bow. Uh, pull in your accent pieces that you use around the lantern up into your bow in some way, you know? And, uh, that's it those are the three rules tray lantern and and jazzed up bow <laughs> and i can't wait to see them i can't wait to see all of the creations but anyway i'm on my way to hobby lobby today by myself uh, chris is doing other stuff today which is fine we're going to meet for lunch later uh, but I am, I'm heading to Hobby Lobby because I'll tell you the truth, you guys, I have not looked through their Christmas stuff yet. I have no idea what I need, but I know that I'm going to be making a tiered tray, as a matter of fact, uh, for Christmas within my Christmas decorations. And I thought, well, wouldn't it be cute to, to give it a theme, maybe snowmen, you know, so I'm thinking of doing maybe a snowman theme or I'm not sure what. It may be snowflakes, it may be snow snowmen, I'm not sure. But I'm gonna look around and see what I can find in a Hobby Lobby. Uh, and that's it for today. That's it for today. I'm not doing any videoing that I know of other than this, obviously. And uh, don't, I'm not doing any editing either. I don't, well, I'll have to edit this later, but hopefully this won't take me long to edit <laughs> and I can get it up for you tomorrow morning probably. So this is uh, Wednesday. This is the day that the tier tray challenge went up, videos went up and I'm just, I'm amazed. I am just amazed at all of the talent and creativity out there. But anyway, it's hotter than the hinges here today. It's uh, 80, well, it's 80 degrees, but it feels like 100 because the humidity is so high, you know. So, doesn't feel like fall. We're getting close to the first day of fall, but it doesn't, doesn't feel like fall quite yet around here, and it won't for another few weeks. So, but eventually these trees will start to change, and I'll take you all for a ride around and flip the camera so you can see out in front and see how you know how pretty it gets in this area and it does it gets so pretty with the changing of the leaves and all of that you guys it's beautiful by the way one more thing let me tell you that I have now lost a bit over 36 pounds not going to claim 37 yet it. <laughs> but have lost over 36 pounds and uh, I'm feeling great, you guys. I'm feeling great, and uh, I feel very, very grateful that I've been able to stick with this and to get, I still have a lot, a lot, a lot of weight to lose, you guys. I'm not even kidding. I probably have, I have over 50 pounds still that I wanna lose. So when all is said and done, you know, I would like to have lost every bit of 90 pounds, uh, if not 100. I would like to take it to 100, but 
I don't know. <laughs> it might take me a very, very, very long time to get there. I'm just working on it one day at a time. One day at a time. And I, when I wake up in the morning and I think, okay, I made it through another day. I made it through another day. I ate right. I feel better. Uh, you know, and like I say, I'm never going to be a small woman, you guys. I'm never going to be teeny tiny and skinny or even thin. <laughs> I'm looking for svelte, maybe, you know. Uh, you know, and I'll be a plus size for quite a while longer here, I'm sure. You know, so I, I had a lot to lose. A lot, a lot, a lot to lose. And I had, I had let myself go for many a year. And that's, you know... Uh, thankfully, my body did not rebel and give me, you know, health problems. Sorry about that. Chris called me. He interrupted my car chit chat. <laughs> uh, but anyway, like I said, I feel so much better. And um, trust me, you guys who are out there who struggle daily uh, with this kind of thing with weight, my heart goes out to you and I'm there with you, you guys. It is so hard. It is the hardest thing in my life. Most definitely the hardest thing in my life. So, but anyway, with all that said, I'm going to hush up now and I'm going to say my, some final words here. Uh, first of all, once again, thank y'all so much. Thank y'all so much for all of your support uh, with these challenges, not only for the challenges, but just for my channel and for me, you guys, I'm, I'm kind of getting personal here a little bit, and but why are you stopping at a green light, buddy? It's interesting behavior there. Uh, but I appreciate all of the support, all of your sweetness. You know, yeah, there's some negativity out there sometimes, but, you know, you just have to brush it off and go on and know that the majority of the time, it's all a positive experience being on YouTube here it has been a very positive and rewarding experience for me and I've met so many wonderful 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 people and I so appreciate every single one of you and with that said I hope that there's no one I know there is though as I hear from you all the time for those of you who are out there struggling with a catastrophic illness or chronic pain I hope that you have someone there with you, helping you get through each day, making the best of each day. I hope that you also have uh, some good pain management, you know, a good doctor who's, who's providing you with some good pain management and that, you know, that helps you get through those days, <clears throat> those difficult days. Uh, I hope that there's nothing weighing on your minds or your hearts, pulling your attention away from where you want it to be or where it should be. And remember, in crafting, not that I'm sitting here with a craft, but in crafting, there are no mistakes, only unique creations. I love y'all to bits, to bits, to bits, hugs all around, and I keep you in my thoughts and my prayers every single day. And with all that said, I'll just say, until next time, y'all take good, good care. Bye-bye.